Hello and welcome back to another video. In this problem, we're asked to guess the value of the limit if it exists by evaluating the function at the given numbers correct to six decimal places. So we have the limit as x approaches negative three of x squared minus three x over x squared minus nine. So we have to evaluate this fraction at the given values. So first we have these values, which are approaching negative three from the right. We have x, and x squared minus 3x over x squared minus 9. So we have negative 2.5, negative 2.9, negative 2.95, negative 2.99, negative 2.999, and negative 2.9999. So evaluating these, we get, if you plug these into your calculator, negative 5, negative 29, negative 59, negative 299, negative 2,999, and negative 29,999. And it says correct to six decimal places, but the point at which there is another decimal that isn't a zero after these is like 10 down the ride. So this is correct to six decimal places, no rounding necessary. And next we have to do all the values approaching from the left. So negative 3.5, negative 3.1, negative 3.05, negative 3.01, 3.001, and 3.0001. And these are as follows for x squared minus 3x over x squared minus 9. And again, these are so close to whole numbers that we don't even have to put a decimal in. 7, 31, 301, 3001. Or sorry, this has to be, uh, I skipped one. This is 7, 31, 61, 301, 3001, and um, 30,001. So we can see that these values are going off to negative infinity, and these values are going off to positive infinity. Right? As we get closer and closer, they're being multiplied by a value of 10 every time, so it's just going to go off to infinity and negative infinity. But because they're not going off to the same value, Right? One's going up to negative and one's going up to positive. The function, or the, rather the limit, DNE does not exist.